Hey guys, it's time for another one page at a time. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys all the pages that I did in here. All right, so the first page that I started back out on for this week said, give me a high five, pat yourself on the back, wave to a friend, or draw your hand in mine. So I did not go anywhere on this day. And so I decided to draw my hand on top of his. And I was trying to do the 3D hand thing. I don't know if you guys have ever seen it, but in case you haven't, I will find a picture and leave it somewhere in this video. Uh, but technically, it's supposed to make your hand look really cool and 3D-like, and I was trying to do that in rainbow form, and it ended up failing miserably, but I still like the way that it turned out. It's really pretty and colorful. So, yeah, there's my hand on top of his, and I just have rainbow all over this page, so I really like it. The next page said, tape a loop of thread to this page so you never forget that one thing. And then it has a finger. And this made me think back to this quote that I used to like. An invisible red thread connects those who are destined to meet regardless of time, place, or circumstance. The thread may stretch or tangle, but it will never break. And so I put that in here and I put a little heart. And then I just drew two pinkies and I tried to wrap the thread, the red thread, around their pinkies and then just make it connect. And I really liked that idea because that quote is one of my favorites and I just thought that it was too cute. So The next page said, hey, are you feeling okay? So I just put, I'm okay in giant letters and then I put not in between it so it says I'm not okay. And then I just put like this little emo drawing of this girl where she's crying and she has a frown and she's holding this mask that has like a smiley face in front of her. And then underneath of that I put, and I've learned it's okay to not be okay all the time. So that was really simple, but that was all I did to this page on that day. And I'm not emo, but I thought that it was really cute and that is how I was feeling on this day. Yeah, and I do feel like that sometimes, so yeah. The next page said, close your eyes, there's nothing to see here, and that is the point. Screen, which used to come on, I don't know if it used to come on the television. It's kind of like an old television. nothing to see here I immediately thought of the please stand by screen um, that used to come on televisions back in the day so I just made this really colorful and put please stand by up at the top and that's all I did to that page since it said there was nothing to see here and that was what I thought of so the next page said number one draw a beautiful frame number two put nothing in it and number three good job so I did exactly as I was told and I just drew a little frame that has different colored polka dots and then has this little swirly thing in the middle and a bow. So I really like it. I think that it's really cute. The next page said just to be quiet and it was a black piece of paper so I just put this quote on here that is so true. Oh. And I um, made like flowers coming out of it and like petals falling and little squiggles. And, and uh, Shut the fuck up! Sorry, you guys. I'm getting so pissed off right now because I lit my candle and nothing is on fire, but my candle is like flaming up and it's making my freaking smoke alarm go off and it's pissing me off. So I blew up my candle so it would not keep interrupting me in the middle of me trying to film a video. Oh my god. So for the millionth time, <laughs> this page said just be quiet and it had a black piece of paper. And when I heard Just Be Quiet, I immediately thought of this quote that is so true for me. It says, 
quiet people have the loudest minds. So I put that quote in here and I drew like a head and like the person's mind and I drew like flowers coming out of their brain, not really their brain but their head and little squigglies in and around their head and like petals falling and everything. And that is so true for me because I am a very quiet person, yet half the time I have a really loud mind. So this quote was so true. The following and the last page for this past week had like a little Instagram reference it says to draw your lunch or the sky or whatever. So I drew the sky and this is not the greatest drawing, I'm going to be honest. It was kind of quick, but um, yeah, I drew the sky and the very bluish gray clouds that were in the sky at this moment. So yeah, that was that page and those were all the pages that I did my own page at a time this past week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big ol' thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already and become a morbid maniac. And please leave a comment and let me know what your favorite page was from this past week. Mine has to be the invisible thread one or the hand page just because I liked the rainbow. So let me know yours and I will see you guys in my next video.